received me giving her the same love and affection that he gave her when he was alive. I vividly remember when I got daddy making love to my mom. The three of us were in the kitchen. Daddy was sitting for my mom was waiting for my mom's oven. I saw him looking at mom with all the love in his eyes. The these people were shouting. She's a molten mess this very morning. Problem was, he saw me, saw him looking at her with all the love in But I believe that he said, very love to the love mommy was. He declared, and they in their 70s, love never faded. That's the understatement of the century, I said, and avoiding adding. You don't have to speak love. In the more than 50 years that they were together, 54 to be exact, I never saw them eat separately and at different times. My dad was a sound engineer in the movies, and a lot of times he would edit till the we are. At home, mommy would wait for him for dinner, or take a few bites to join us, and take her full meal when daddy arrived. No, she needed not to wake up the helper to warm his food or eat the dishes. Service to my dad was totally her fault. Short of saying to my dad, you enslave yourself working for your family. It's time that I treat you as my king. Short of having the status for a background. If I'm your slave, then it's the slave one me. When daddy went ahead 50 years ago, I knew that the great love and peaceful marriage half died, and we were afraid she would follow him in due time. We try to give her all that we are the best and try not to make her feel the three greatest fears of old age. Not to be loved, not to be needed, and not to be secured by her loved ones. Every so often, birthdays and anniversaries were reasons to reunite and hold a birthday party. A party. The hidden agenda was to see mommy happy, see us happy together as a family. The times that there were only the two of us at home, I never <laughs> failed to hug and kiss her whenever we met or across our way. On my way to the kitchen, the living room, and if we stay in 36 square meters, that means a dog, a dog